There was a lady who mentioned that she experienced about two years of horrible ear aches and headaches. When she went for a checkup, the doctor could not find anything wrong with her ears. Her ears were clear, and she had also massive headache. In the end, the doctor discharged her, or more or less dismissed her, and told her that perhaps she. Should consider to get some massage by her husband, and looking in the fact that she had、uh, trauma and stress, it could be the、um, the symptoms that she be that she's having could be like imaginary. When I read about this, I advise her to actually consider to see a dentist, because usually when people have ear ache. We won't associate with、uh, the issue could could be somewhere else, but from my experience, if there is a decay tooth or a tooth with、um, the filling has come out, and then the bacteria enter through the tube, it can cause pain in.、Um, In the sometimes toothache, sometimes the toothache is not present, and the pain goes to the ear, or we call it as referred pain. So it it can the pain can happen at the ears, at the throat.、Um, we can have sinuses. Our eyes can have like conjunctivitis, and we can have headache. Why is this possible? Is because all these channels are linked via the. Uh, via a single passageway called the eustachian tube, it connects、uh, all this together. So, when the easiest way for the bacteria to enter our body is via an infected tooth, via food,、um, and sometimes、uh, poor oral hygiene, or if we if we really have a Uh, plaque, right? And we still continue to take like sweet things, and we don't brush our teeth immediately.、Um, don't do frequent flossing, so food stuff gets stuck in our teeth, and then when it rots, bacteria grow. And if we don't brush it,、uh, our teeth well enough,、um, clean enough, and the food stuff is there, after a while, the bacteria with the filling coming off, it may. And the, sometimes the food stuff goes into the uh, filling, uh, the uh, the tooth where the filling has come off. So then the bacteria enter the eustachian tube, and then it causes pain. So of course, stress has a role to play in this as well. I find I have experienced this incident twice, at least twice,、um, major one during my time when I was in corporate. With、um, the more stress I am. The more painful and the more area is is spread, whereby I actually got the toothache, I got the sore throat, I got the earache, and I got headache, and my eyes felt was a bit red. So normally people go to ENT for this, but then in the case of the lady who mentioned about the pain, right? I'm sure she has actually gone to the ENT and have checked because she suffered two years. And if you are in a similar situation as her, I strongly, strongly advise you to get your teeth checked. Sometimes, surprisingly, you may have a bit of irritation on the tooth. It's not a massive pain because the bacteria has gone elsewhere. And normally, if our if we are okay, if our life is not stressed, our immune system is quite strong. With stress. With um emotional um disturbance、um, when we are not well or we take um we don't take care of our diet and there's a lifestyle that、uh, we we are not that active, it may lower our immune system. So when our immune system is not functioning at its best, then it's easier for this infection to spread. So normally, if the dentist check and um. And they fix the issue with the tooth. You will immediately feel the pain literally going off.、Uh, most of it, maybe left about ninety, ninety-five percent. That was what I felt. And then after that, when the doctor put me on a round of antibiotics, the pain go off completely. 
So this is something I wish you will consider. If you have like even if you have massive headache and you know that uh, maybe your dental you don't check as often, the headache as long as it's a disturbance connect uh, with the uh, organs that connects to your an op- um, that connects to your eustachian tube, then get get your um, teeth checked. I hope that it's going to help and I hope that you're going to feel better uh, and, and that your problem will be solved. This is taught to me by my mom last time um, because as a nurse, she has actually seen patients, her patient who experienced this and that w- was the cause. So she learned from her patient and she shared with me. And when I go to the dentist to have my tooth checked and it, it's always like the feeling has come off and then he, he, he cleaned up the tooth and then he did the feeling again and put me on a round of antibiotics and, um, and I totally recovered. So when a few of my friends um, have the issue, I also told them the same thing and they too went and have their teeth checked and they recovered. So hopefully this helps. Um, take care.